No holds barred, you know that. When two superstars agree to a match like this, they must be ready to tear each other apart limb by limb. That's right, Michael. This is one of the most dangerous matches you can have here in WWE. The damage goes way beyond typical scrapes and bruises. This could have some serious long-term ramifications. And Fiend falls to a counter. Boom, running STO plants him. Nicely done. Lots in the gut wrench. Suplex! Taking their time. Oh, vertical suplex. Look at the power here. Absolutely incredible. Walking around the ring. That with a one arm. Oh, he's got him here. He's got him up. And power with a sidewalk slam. Caught with a lariat. Stomping away. And then the knee right into the throat. Just ruthless. Prime example of working smarter, not harder. That's what I say. Sidewalk slam! Almost drove him through the ring. And the Fiend just can't mount any offense. Call animal control. Batista's loose. Escape just in time. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. A brutal impact on that DDT. Off body. Batista turns it around. Going right after the neck. Neck breaker. Oh, they're just punishing their opponent now. And look at front a back suplex. Corey, what are the perils of this match that superstars must be concerned with? Now, this is the type of setting where you must be aware of outside interference because when it's no disqualification, it's not considered interference. It's legal. The match can change in an instant when another individual who is not officially part of the match makes their presence felt. That's when a competitor needs to utilize the anything go stipulation to their benefit and eliminate the mismatch. Batista demonstrating that unrivaled power. A dismantling power, the kind of power that shatters tectonic plates. Face first. He's starting to struggle here. Yeah, as Batista just unleashed on him. Could be a sign of things to come. Bludgeoning them with that back. Oh, the guns are hurt. And these attacks are spelling nothing but trouble. And you can tell there are true intentions in mind right now. Big time clothesline. Good grief. Momentum moving towards Batista's corner. The Fiend is finding no salvation here. Looking for something, anything under the ring. He is looking to unload on his opponent with that kendo stick. Kendo stick to the skull. Turning the tables there. Locks in the gut wrench. Suplex. Set up in the corner of the ring. Oh, strikes with the back elbow. He can't take any more of this. He can really stand to give back as good as he's getting right about now. And the Fiend is finally able to mount some resistance with that. If the Fiend was looking for an opportunity to pull a 180, that could be it. Quick shoulder up. What is it going to take to put him away? Ripcord. Lariat. No escape for him. Jarring impact. Elbow drop. Piercing. And he heads out of the ring. No count outs, no worries. No clue what he hopes to find down there. He's looking to absolutely destroy his opponent with that chair. The Fiend dodges that attack. Oh, gentlemen, what a surprise. Yeah, we're all surprised, including 
the superstar inside the ring. He can't believe it. Ah, oh, flipping the script on him there. Quick exchange of counters there. Got the full Nelson. Slam! Boom, right back. The Fiend has no control here. Watch out, the end. Wait a second, could be a matter of time. Submission being locked in. And you imagine what it would do to his cup. And he's able to fend off what must have been a grueling submission. Plants him. Nicely done. What impact! Ryan McKissick. Boom! He saw that one coming. Boom! One wicked attack after another. Spinning side slam! Batista's unleashed. Something tells me the Fiend enjoys some of this pain. And he has to start protecting himself from attacks to that area. We are seeing the will to win from these men. Not an ounce of quit in them. The struggle to gain power has switched hands multiple times. It's been a seesaw battle at times. Oh, the table's being set on fire. Oh, I can't watch this. I can't watch this at all. Not many people escape defeat after Batista gets hold of you and executes that maneuver. And he has answers for Batista. The animal about to become prey. Fought off with an elbow. Pulled in for a family to belly. No mercy being shown to the fiend here. The animal is in full force. The position you want to be in right now. Through the table, through the table, through for the win. Two. And that will do it. It's finally over with the win. Now here's a look at some of the clips that made that street fight so much fun, at least for us. Here is your winner. The Celebrate this win. You deserve it for focusing up and keeping your eye on the ball. See? The distraction didn't even phase them in the long run. Corey, they win in spite of it. I don't know. I think it gave them the motivation they needed to win this one. For someone who loves the sound of his own voice, do you ever hear yourself? Oh, man. Referee hit hard here. Well, the ref got hit hard there. You can see as he rises how vulnerable of a position he's in. Looking for it. Here it comes. 